Hello everybody, Keith Hershey here. This is National Love People Day. Think of that. This is the day that's on the National Register, National Love People Day. Actually, this was founded by Pastor Reggie and London Royal and the Saints of Lifeline Church in Chicago. Uh, you can go online, get more information about this whole uh, plan they have, just to encourage people around America and really around the world to love one another. It's a really, really exciting opportunity for all of us and it's what our world needs. And all this month I've been teaching a little bit on being loved today, so we're equipped to love one another. But I'm doing it from the Song of Songs, the greatest song of all time, the Song of Songs. It it's, should be premier in our mindset, but it's really about Jesus' love for you. It's Christ's love for the bride. It's, 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 it shows the intensity and passion of it. It's really rich and thrilling and exciting. And we need to be immersed in this kind of radical love that God has for us. We need to be receptive to it so we can be transformed and we're equipped then to love one another. Actually, in the Song of Songs, chapter 4, verse 9 and 10, this is Christ speaking to the bride. And he said, you have ravished my heart, my goodness, what an intense statement. Do you really believe that? Do you believe that you have ravished his heart? This is what he thinks about you. This is what he says concerning you, you as a believer, you as the bride of Christ. Just one look at you, he says. You've ravished my heart. He says, with one look of your eyes, with one link of your necklace, how fair is your love my sister, my spouse? How much better than wine is your love? This is what Christ says to you and me, the church. We've ravished his heart. I want you to know today that the love of God for you is so intense, even when you just give him a quick look, a quick gaze. That's why the Bible talks about we look unto Jesus. We look unto Jesus. Every time we look to Jesus, there's a thrill that he gets with us. When you behold the Lamb of God, when you look unto Jesus, you know, John uh, said this, look, behold the Lamb of God, which takes away the sin of the world. Every time you look, every time you behold Jesus, you're transformed into the very image of the Bible teaches of who he is. You've got to take time and behold, you've got to look. And the Bible also teaches in this Song of Songs that his heart is so intentionally, in, intently ravished just when we look to him, when we look to be loved by him. I want you to know, friend, today, as you reach out to others, make sure you're loved by Jesus first. Make sure you know and you believe that your sins are forgiven and they are forgotten. Know and believe that everything he's accomplished at Calvary is a done deal. It's a once and for all deal. You have an eternal redemption. And know for certain that his heart is ravished every time he takes a glance at you because he knows you have take a, a view. You're drawing from him the living word. So take time in the word. Take time in prayer. Take time talking. Take time discussing your, your heartaches, your, 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 your situations. Uh, take time to discuss everything, but look unto him and let his love be your full supply. Thanks. Hope you enjoy the day. And don't forget, because of Jesus, you can be assured God loves you completely. And we do too.